Hello to all my friends. Today, uh, the content that I'm trying to share to you is, is about the uh, catfish. We can say that they are really lucky today because the uh, the reason that the uh, people they bought those catfish from the market is to cook them, eat them, eat them as a meal. For meal for the people that who's buying them but I I bought them today alive from the hawkers so that they have a chance to live not even for today as long as they can swim in this Yangon River <laughs> so this is a place that I'm trying to let them escape or try to let them go. This is the Zhangong River. So this is the jetty. You can see the view from the background. I'm trying to find a place to let go of them. This place is the first time that I've been there. People trying to work hard to earn their living every day. So this is the uh, catfish that I'm talking about. Not much, but we uh, try to buy them much as I can from the wet market, um, so that they can swim in the uh, Yangon River really freely, instead of people eat them as their meal, their lunch or dinner. So that's why. The yeah, title of content is that the yeah, lucky catfish. Okay, the main thing that I'm trying to share is that you yeah, try to do all the good things as you can in life. When you do good things, good things will turn back to you. It's like cause and effect. Since we are Buddhism. Uh, we believe in cause and effect. So if you do good things, good things will return to you. Same thing as on the other side as well. So please continue doing all the good things in life as many as you can and spend the rest of your life doing all the good things as you can. Hope you enjoy watching this content. and get my point of doing good things in life and reflection of cause and effect in life this is what we can learn from this content